Captain Scott. We're uh, heading out on the Sandusky Bay. It's May 18th. A little chilly today. A little bit, a little bit windy, but not too bad. Uh, but we're gonna go catch some some channel catfish. Uh, should be a a great day on the water. Got those two in the boat. While we're landing those. Got another one on, so basically a triple. So he's still trying to net that one when he hooked this one. So we tripled up. That big one's a good 16, 17 pounds. We'll weigh it here in just a second. Now we got another one on. We got these three finally in the boat, and that makes four. That uh, one of them was 18.3, one of them 16.8. That other one's close to you know it's about eight pounds so beautiful uh beautiful fish already this morning fish all over the boat it's a good start to the day just like that we are on again now we doubled again they just missed two we got two on so heck this could have been a quad <laughs> Just uh, hard to match the fish from here anywhere. When you catch, you know, 16 and a half, like 18 and a half, or whatever size that fish was, and you're catching four fish at a time, it's, uh, it's hard to do that anymore. There, that one's up to the top. They're going ahead and netting that one. This group's doing a lot of my work for me today. I keep them around. This is all right. Yeah, I get that. All right. Well, we yeah, we got another one. I got got lost him. It's uh, five minutes after eight. We've already got six fish in the boat. We started at eight o'clock, so that's a pretty good start. We're releasing those. We doubled up again. Oops. Here, I'll net that for you. Just give me. Oh, there's another nice fish. I was busy trying to show you that double they were catching, and I didn't get to that quite quick enough. So one of them snapped off. We got another beautiful fish in the boat. Way they're coming, it won't be long before he has them out. This guy is wearing them out back here in the back of the boat. Again, you might have to raise up and then reel as you're dropping the rod tip down. The more that squeals, the more your line twists, the harder it makes it to fish with. Is that what it is? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, if it's squealing, you're not gaining any line, it's just twisting it. They lost a little one up front. That wasn't even the channel. That bullhead just lost. Try to get a quick peek at him. There he is. Let's get the net. And now we're starting to get some smaller fish. Put in the cooler. We got got the big one. He just landed right here. That's uh, that's ten pounds at least. Got another nice one here that'd be just right to eat. And another one on in the back. That's four. Now this one here in the back seems to be a pretty good fish. We already got those other fish taken care of. He's still fighting this one. Put that big one back, put two little ones in the cooler. Oh, that's a monster right there. There we go. That one is 18 and three quarter pounds. Just a monster, a beautiful fish. We got one in the net. We got one hooked. So, he's coming to the top. Looks like another uh, sandwich size fish. Oh, that's a beautiful eater right there. That's just constant action. Another one here in the back of the boat. His arm's going to be tired by the time he goes home. Oh no! 
Oh well, I'll re even rig back up and back in the water. We got one up here at the side of the boat. And we got one in the back again. <laughs> All right, you miss yours? You haven't missed very many. You've been pulling them in. Oh, uh oh, that broke the line. It's all right. I'll get you going again. Yeah, that snapped the line. It... Oh well, I'll get your rig back up. So to get this fish in the boat. I got your other rod here. Get another rod here. All I got is put a hook on it. It'll be ready. There just hasn't been much time between fish. To... They're netting another big one back in the back here. Hold that one up a second. This one come in right at 17 pounds. It's so big, I can't even get the whole thing in the screen. This one's 15 pounds, six ounces. Uh, it's been crazy today. A lot of action to see. Uh, some of this footage comes out a little goofy. It's just because I'm hustling today. Now we're hooked up again. Any of you guys sitting at home, watching this if you haven't booked a trip of your own but now you just don't know what you're missing Whoa. you won't match a fishing trip like this anywhere else Okay, there's two fish, just about 10 pounds a piece. Uh, just drug him off the back of the boat at the same time. It's one right after another all day long. It's a beautiful fish. It's about 14 pounds. So that'd be a fish of a lifetime in most places. And we've been catching them like that, just one right after another. Another one on here in the back. One of the guys is nice enough to volunteer as a net man. He doesn't realize I'm going to have to charge him for a first bait now that somebody else is netting the fish. I have to charge him extra. <laughs> I don't think there's an ATM out here. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. We'll just put it on your tab. I'm sure you'd rather own me forever than to beat me out of it. Another big one. Let's see if we can get a picture of that as it comes out of the water. It's Another monster. Been out here about an hour. We figure we have to have caught at least 30 of them, and uh, a lot of them have been up over 15 pounds off this one spot. Never moved. We'll sit out here the full four hours, and if if we can, and uh, catch them like that the whole time we're out here. That's a good fish. Can you kind of turn that around a little bit so people can see it? Oh, it's a beautiful fish. That's somewhere between 13 and 14, probably closer to 14 pounds right there. That's a gorgeous fish right there. We're hooked up again. 
there on the side of the boat. That's been another hot seat. Currents running towards the back of the boat, and everybody's lines going about the same place. But uh, there's a few people have been just wearing them out. I think it's more about the fishermen than it is the spot because, uh, like I said, everybody's lines going to the same spot. It's another big fish. Tell the way it's it's just not coming to the top. There's only been a handful of little ones. There's been a lot more big fish than there's been little ones. It's up, it's up close to the surface, but there he is. We are just catching trophy fish all day long. That's another, well, that's a good 13. Some are 12, 12 to 13 pounds. Still awesome fish. We're hooked up again. They might have one he can eat this time. We're just one hour into the trip right now. And uh, I don't, can't even tell you how many we've caught. I'm sure it's over 30. Uh, just uh, one hour in, we got three more to go. Yeah, I just shut off the camera and he hooked up again. So that's a big one this time. There he is. Oh, look at this splash. Now we got one back of the boat. They've been catching them so yeah. They've been catching them so uh, so fast in the back of the boat that they're playing musical chairs. They <laughs> we've had a couple people give up their seat back here just so that everybody else can catch a make their arms are getting tired. All right, uh, give me, give me, okay, go say. Oh, well, we'll get that as soon as we get this fish in. I grabbed it. I just got one in the boat back here. They got one hooked up there, one in the boat here, one hooked up here. That's four fish at once. I got to get the net again. All right. That looks like a, that looks like one for the frying pan. There hasn't been very many of them. Yeah. There's been a whole lot more fish released than there's been kept. Yeah, it's a, just a really nice size to eat right there. Yeah, we got us a double side by side. Uh, a little one and a medium sized one. But hey, still two fish at once. We got, got one hooked up there. We got one going back here, one there. Uh, two 14 to 16 pound fish and one for the cooler. You got another one. Yeah, that's a nice eater right there. Well, there's the cooler. We're an hour and a half into the trip. We've thrown away, or we've thrown back um, far more than we've kept, not only in weight, but in numbers. We've thrown back more fish than we've kept. And uh, that's still what they got in the cooler. I did. I didn't like that one, though. Yeah. All right, we're hooked up again. Got a couple big fish on. Gonna wrap up the video for this trip. We're only about halfway into the trip. 
if this was a walleye trip, you'd already be back at the dock. But now, heck, the captain would be sitting at the bar working on his third beer. But now, if it, uh, yeah. Here, here you book a four-hour trip, a six-hour trip. You, you fish the whole time, so unless you decide you want to go in, we'll fish till it's over. Cooler's already full. Can't get another fish in it. All these big ones have been going back. Need two more big ones right here. I, I gotta get the net. So that's it for today. 24 pounds, 6 ounces. Uh, we weren't going to video anymore, but that's a big fish of the year so what? far. <laughs> <laughs> and that, that fish is still fighting. That's what a real fish looks like, boys. 24 pounds, 6 ounces. That's a big fish of the year so far. We've got 12 of them now. 20 pounds or better just in May. And it's only the 18th. All right, for it once again, the biggest of the four was 24 pounds, 6 ounces. So, four of them come in all at once. Chaos all day long. Well, thanks for watching our video. Uh, we had a great day, as you can see. One of my best days I've had of the year so far. The biggest fish I've had so far this year. Uh, 24 pounds, 6 ounces. Uh, we've had 12 now. 20 pounds or better. And it's only the 18th of May. Uh, you just can't hardly beat it. Come on out. Join the fun.